गुड मॉर्निंग गाइज वेलकम टू अनदर ब्लॉग माई नेम शशांक एंड यूर वॉचिंग दिस फ्राम मधुरई वी आव जस्ट कम फ्राम कोची एंड वी हैड अ वंडरफुल ट्रिप बैक इन कोची एंड मोनाट राइट नाउ वी आर सेटल ऑफ इन मधुरई इट्स अ वेरी अर्ली मॉर्निंग आई एक्चुअली डिन गेट स्लीप सो थॉट ऑफ कमिंग अप ओवर हियर एंड जस्ट टेकिंग अ टाइम लैप ऑफ दिस ब्यूटिफुल सन राइज विच यूर ऑफ जस्ट सीन बिफोर एनी वाइज सो टूडे माई सेल्फ एंड अंकल आर गन गो ऑन एन एडवेंचर अप दिस माउंटेन कॉल पिरान मलाई मलाई मीन्स माउंटेन इन तमिल वी गन हाइक अप एक्चुअली ट्रैक अप फोर थाउजेंड फीट अबव द ग्राउंड एम नॉट श्योर बट दैन या समथिंग अबाउट दैट एंड आई कीप यू गैज अपडेटेड ऑन द स्टैच एंड स्टफ एंड बिफोर दैट आई एम गन शो यू गैज वॉट ऑल टू पैक फॉर अ वन डे ट्रैक या सो आई टेक यू गैज अलॉन्ग and let's see what we're going to pack right now let's go all right so i've just uh, scattered out few items which i'm going to be placing onto this bag for this trip today firstly starting off with the pocket torch which can be used at night a tripod manual map in case we don't have access to the internet monopod camera a phone holder which can be placed uh, for the tripod as well as the monopod and the camera bag which consists of extra batteries and extra sd cards rain coats Um, Odomos, which is a mosquito repellent ointment, hand sanitizer, wet wipes, normal tissues, deodorants, bandana, and uh, a muscle tape. Coming down to the eateries, we have uh, candies. Candies are a vital source of energy, same as bananas, which provide high energy. Apples, just to keep your uh, water flowing in the mouth. And that tin right there consists of dry fruits and nuts. Kakra is an Indian whole wheat uh, baked bread, which is a good source of crunch, and uh, a bottle of water, which is all that you need to survive this trek. Guys, have a look at that mountain. That's the mountain we're going to be trekking at. What? Right so we just arrived at the venue at the base point and uh this big mountain right there that's where we're going to go at the top and there's my uncle he'll be following me i mean i'll be following him rather and yeah let's do this Awesome guys so we just made some great progress right now I've also turned on my S health on my Samsung so to show you guys uh, how much kilometers is this trek along the forest and we made some great progress as you can see the view point behind It's dense green forest. It's like almost we're walking through the canopy. Started to to rain a little bit. Slight drizzles, and yeah, going on. Whew. That the top. That's where we're going. and we've almost made it guys Almost feels like the world right now. We made it. Although I have to check how many uh, kilometers we walked, it's in my pocket. We'll do that soon. But have a look at the view, guys. It's insane.
200 to 300 years back, uh, a Muslim man came over here on top of this hill and stayed over here for the rest of his life. And they have made that like this place, holy worship place, uh, incredible. And uh, it just shows how determined that person was. I'm not quite sure about their history, but yeah, this was what I've understood from what the priest has told. So, I don't know about the timing. The timing was kind of wrong, but we've covered about 4.96 kilometers, 4.6 kilometers per hour. And yeah, so that's the distance we've covered from base point, 4.96 kilometers. Crazy, right? Pretty insane. Uh, I just love these kind of tricks with sunset over happening over that side. It's a drop on the other side. And yeah, just soaking into this atmosphere feels really great. Fingers crossed. I just hope the time lapse has come out really well because the sunset was truly beautiful. It was like for me, sunset and sunrise is like one of the best wonders of the world. And uh, it's dark. It's getting dark, and uh, through the forest, there's not even a single light. So torch is and flashlight is all we've got. So we're trying to go fast. Oh, thank God! Damn. <laughs> so yeah, we're going down. It's dark over here, guys. We've just descended to the first pit stop of our trek while we were going on top and another 20 minutes more to go to the base camp and get the bikes ready to head back to Madurai. So it's been a wonderful experience over here thanks to my uncle over here who's here. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's it. We're going back and this experience is totally different because apart from there's no internet, there's no connection to the uh, telecom etc. So it's been really rad and yeah so now we're just gonna go back home and freshen up and catch up on our legs because it's aching like anything. I'll also catch you guys next week. Live young, feel young and stay young. Until next time it's me Shashank. <laughs>